Hey, I'm Alastair from Trail and Kill, coming at you with another no-nonsense review. And today I am looking at the very unusual but awesome looking Ombras armless sunglasses. So as you can see, if you look on the side, these bad boys have no arms to them. So that makes them really comfortable to wear and awesome for athletes like ourselves who want something or sunglasses that are super lightweight and will just stick to your head. Won't go anywhere. Uh, so these ones right here are the Ombras Dolomite frames. I also have the classic frames with me which I'll show you soon. This review is more of a hands-on kind of show you what they look like, show you how they feel, show you how they work as well. There is a in-depth review on trailandkale.com if you want to learn more about these frames, learn more about the Ombras brand and the company behind these sunglasses because it is a cool story. Uh, they're a great company and you should definitely go learn more about them. And also all the really fine specifications of these sunglasses. Um, definitely go check out that review. I've put a link down in the description and I'll put one up here as well. All right then, so first off is the look. The style of a Dolomite I really like actually. Uh, it kind of reminds me of the old climber style sunglasses where you kind of block off the sides of the sunglasses so that you don't get snow blindness uh, whilst you're climbing. And there is a little bit of block on the side there. There is a little bit of thickness, but there isn't full block on the sides of the Dolomite. Um, but the style is really good. It shows you know, that they've got the ability to make really stylish looking sunglasses. Uh, so that is a great start. All right, so I'm going to take these off. First of all, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you look at the back here, this is the cordage. All I do is pull the cord on the outside and they loosen and then the cordage stretches to the, um, well, it doesn't stretch, it expands to the uh, full width of the sunglasses. So. What you can actually do then is wear them around your neck, which is really cool as well, so you don't have to stick them on your head or um, lose them accidentally. You can literally just slap them around your neck like this. So you might think if sunglasses didn't have arms that they might be a little bit loose or uncomfortable, but actually that's the complete opposite. Um, the sunglasses fit really comfortably and you don't have the arms sticking into your temples or the area behind your ears here. Um, so when you're wearing these sunglasses for long periods of time, they're actually much more comfortable than sunglasses with arms. So they have really innovated here um, in creating these sunglasses. So kudos to Ombras there. Let me just show you the kind of how this works at the back. So you can see the clasp here and it's a really great system. It's very grippy so you don't have to worry about this coming loose when it's on your head. You know there is some tension there um, and I really <laughs> I'm really actually impressed with how easy this is to put on and undo so you would just make it to its widest. Put them over your head like this and then pull those two cords until it's snug on the back of your head. Job done, you got your sunglasses on. And uh, these are great for running. I've tried them a few times and to give you an example, I'm shaking my head like crazy and they are not going anywhere. So you don't have to worry about that. Ombra sunglasses are excellent for running as well. Okay, so there are a few things that I should point out. Um, a couple of downsides would be that it is a bit awkward if you like to wear your sunglasses on your hat. Like I said earlier, you can just wear them around your neck. But if you're running and you don't want to be wearing them on your eyes, then yeah, you can kind of, you know, you would have to make them kind of fall <laughs> as wide as you can on the, the cordage and then get them in place and then tighten them like that. And yeah, you know, they do stay there. But that's a little bit awkward to be honest. And um, I can see that being a little bit of an issue if 
you know you're doing some kind of sport and you want to take your sunglasses off to get a better look at maybe the trails ahead uh, if you're in shade or whatnot um, and you just want to be able to take them off put them over your cap see what's going on and I think what I would like to see in the next release of Ombra's um, fastening system would be to have a little bit of elasticity in there so you can pull them away from your face and put them over your hat and that would stay in place. Um, that would be really cool to see and I can see that being useful for climbers as well or anyone who has to wear a hard hat whilst wearing these sunglasses because if you can imagine the cordage would be inside the hat and you'd have your sunglasses on, the hat would be over that cordage so it would be very difficult to get these sunglasses off your face um, with that hat on and there will be situations where you don't really want to get that hard hat off your head for safety reasons so I can see it being a really cool feature just having a little bit of elasticity in there so you could pull it away from your face maybe put it under your put the sunglasses under your chin or stretch them out and put them onto your hat something like that that's my only really um, thing that I think the ombre sunglasses could benefit from so I'd love to get your thoughts in the comments below. Uh, let me know what you think of the style. Let me know what you think about armless sunglasses as a concept as well. Would you try them? Have you tried them? Get the conversation going down in the comments below. Um, yeah, love to know your thoughts. These were a big hit with me. I really like the styles and I like wearing something different to be honest. Um, I mean, how many armless sunglasses have you seen out there before? Not many, right? Finally then, I'll quickly show you the classic Ombras sunglass frames. It's these guys here. They also look pretty cool. I prefer the style of a Dolomite personally, but I like them. It's a great design and they do look good. Final thing I wanted to say is they do come with a carry case. Little carry case there, it says Ombras at the bottom. So that's kind of a no thrills case, uh, does the job. But what's nice is they do include a lens cloth, a cleaning cloth for your lens, and that's attached to the case. So that um, makes things easy, you won't lose that cloth. Alright, well I hope you enjoyed this Ombras Armless Sunglasses review. Uh, drop a comment down below if you enjoyed it. Definitely give this video a like, it uh, really helps our channel grow. And consider subscribing for more outdoor gear reviews uh, that are completely no nonsense and we get straight to the point and tell you whether the product is good or not. In this case, I really like the Ombras Sunglasses. So, it's a hit for us. See you next time.